churning seas of London. Well, yo, Just what's up, guys? Back, like I told you yeah. after I ended that video, I was gonna be right back. But um, shout out, over London. got ten subs. Not but the first three doing part times. three right now, sequence Listen three, so gonna be lit. <gasps> Oi, watch it. This guy just stole my money. Oi! Come back here, you filthy dipper! My sister told me to stop when it's not her. Hey, what? You, Jacob, you're stupid! You just let him go like five times further than he would have if you just. He like. Like, the cutscene ended off by. Oh, there was a chest right there. I should have got it. I'm gonna get desynchronized. And I'm actually trying to not get desynchronized in this whole entire gameplay. So far, so good. But so far, Linden sucks. Not just kidding. Find your little mobs, man. Oh, great. Keep it. Well, well. What do we have here? You're on our property. Oh, this your property, bro. Get out of here. I'm trying to hit. Oh, what? I dodged that. Oh, okay, crap. Dodge. Yeah, that's a good one. Hit me. Let's see if I can do a double takedown. Finish. Oh, there we go. Double takedown. What else does London have to offer? Now All is right. not the time for tourism, Jacob. Yeah, what up, Now's Evie? the time to find Henry Green. I've always been the quicker climber, haven't I? Not since we were two. Bruh, I'm Race on beat. Vantage, ah, get out of here, you slow runner. Oh, crap. She's faster than me! <laughs> oh, run. Oh, I went the wrong way. None of my watch. Ah, Evie got like left behind or something. I'm gonna win again. Gotta get this challenge done. <laughs> yeah, your boy Where won. Is Mr. Green's shop located. It was marked on Father's map. Two assassins, equal in height, one female. One male. I don't think we've actually started old, sequence three yet, no so I'm just smiles. playing on on part three until we finish tricks. sequence three. But and I think we're are. still on Henry sequence Green, two in this. At your service. So I'm just I was sorry to learn about your father's passing. I don't know the exact sequences, but I know uh, the sequences one, what two, and three are confusing to actually get into the gameplay because it actually doesn't tell you when it ends. London must be free. To provide a better future for all of its citizens. Well, thank goodness the council saw reason and sent you to aid us. Yes. Thank goodness. Unfortunately, I am the bearer of bad news. Today, Staric sits at the helm of the most sophisticated Templar infrastructure known in the Western world. Every class, every borough, the gangs, the industries. His reach extends all across London. I've always thought of myself as a gang leader. Firm, but fair. Huh. Well, I have uniforms, and I'll unite a mix of disenfranchised outsiders under one name. That's it, Evie. We can rally them to our side. Oh, like the way that you rallied those card players at the Oakwood Tavern into the river. Oh, that was different. They beat me at whist. I can see it now. We'll call ourselves the, the Rocks. Rocks. You were never good at chess either. Have you got a better plan? Find the piece of Eden. Oh, well, let me show you the lay of the land. Shall we? <gasps> oh, come on, Billy, we'll climb it. Brett. Oh. What is Evie doing? She's just standing there. What a loser. Look at what Staric has done to the city. Whitechapel is riddled with crime. Child labor, despite regulations. A gang known as the Blighters overruns the streets. 
and Templars manipulating behind the scenes. As in all the other boroughs, we need to return this city to the people who built it in the first place. We will free London from Starrick. Mm. You have my word. And my looks. Miss Fry, your passion is inspiring. Come. Let us return to my shop, and I can bring you up to date on the rest. She was diving. Why is it so far away from me? <gasps> Wait. Hey, still got my Etsy outfit and my creatures rags. I like my Etsy outfit more. It gives me more ammo. You know, your boy loves more ammo. looking for me. Who's Kalok? One of Starrick's gang leaders. Why does he want you? He's after some of my more arcane research into one of the precursor artifacts. The Peace of Eden. Man. So tell me about these blighters. In search of an army, Starrick gathered up the nastiest of the underworld. Some of the city's gangs tried to prevent it and were slaughtered for their efforts. Now, only Whitechapel's clinkers remain opposed, but they're no match for the blighters. Well, let's shine these clinkers up then, shall we? They're just the sort we're looking for. You can't be serious. Evie, they're ready to fight and oppose the blighters. This is my chance to step in. Look out, London. Here come the rooks. <laughs> Confound this city. No one looks where they're going. Yes, I've noticed that. Bloody drood. I'll never finish it at this rate. Only Providence knows where those words are headed now. Well, I must get to work replacing them. Should you ever be in the mood for a tale or two, you can always find me where the ale is warm and tempers are hot. Ta-ta! Ta -ta. What an odd man. That Mr. Fry was Charles Dickens. Knows everyone and everything in the city. If I were you, I would keep that connection in your back pocket. Kalok's gang is nearby. They must not follow me back to my shop. We'll take care of it. Yeah. You might be able to use this. Oh. oh God, I hope so. My carriage is nearby. Make use of it to throw them off my trail. I will meet you at the curio shop. That's a girl. We need to lead them away from Green. Here comes trouble. Their carriages are easily to through the day. Yes. They've gone. <laughs> oh, the body crew so far. Now to return to Mr. Green. Aye, aye, Captain. You're relentless. That relentlessness will see me become master when we finish this. George would do nothing of the sort. Whatever's left of the creed would perish under your control. Harsh words, dear sister. Ooh. The new drift and you have so cool or smart and Don't tell me you fancy the bloke already. And what do you suggest we do if I'm not going to show some information turns out dead? Starry can't be that hard to find. I say we turn the carriage around and go find him. This is why you aren't in charge. Oh Alright. Yes, there were some sparks there. Uh, I was just on this wheel. Alright, we're here. Let's get out. Come on, eBay. Wow. Pushing me. I don't even know where I'm going. Did 
Did you give them the slip? We gave them more than that. <laughs> Who are all these people? Over the years, I have established a number of connections across the city. Splendid. We'll need focused aid. Focused aid? <sighs> we take over Starek's gangs, we cripple his control. You're not aiming high enough. Starek has influence in every branch of society. We need to match it. I see what you're saying, Evie. We need the Rooks. You are not starting a gang called the Rooks. I believe I may have an idea of my own. We will need the police to turn a blind eye to our activities. My ally in the force, Sergeant Abilene. I've heard he's a master of disguise. Next up, urchins. 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 Children make for excellent spies. Clara O'Day. Smart as a whip, that one. Finally. Your guys, hold on. I'll be right back. Remember that. Staric never acts alone. There are gang leaders in every borough. You'll meet them soon enough, no doubt. Rexford Gaylock. Known for his ability to vanish before your very eyes. Should we make him vanish for real? I suppose. One moment. Um, a Templar target you might want to look into. Uh, be cautious. It's rough out there. No, don't worry about me, Greenie. I can handle a few thugs. Yo guys, I'm back. Sorry, I just had to grab a blanket. It's really cold in my house. It's really cold. Alright. So we have started Sequence 3, so that's good news. I didn't think we did. Alright, let's get into this. Conquer the Lodge. Alright. Let's get this. Good Abilene. Oh. What's you know the what plan then? Do? Oh mighty planner. I need to get my skills up. Slayer. You always need to get Slayer, guys. Always. Always get Slayer to that one person that's watching. Eagle Vision 2. Get that. And then you gotta get this. Yay, level two. I'm so cool. I love my way I walk. I love the way I talk. Hey, health boost. All right, if they would let me switch to Eevee, I'd be able to put on that outfit that I got for her. And let's get out of here. I need to switch to you, so I'm just going to run away from you. If you insist. following me. Oh. Wow, there we go. All right. See, Evie favors a stealth approach where Jacob is more confrontal. So I told you guys in the very beginning, Evie is more stealth. All right. So now I can switch. Put on that dope outfit that I have for her. All right. I got a dope outfit. Oh yeah, this is the outfit. And I gotta put on a different cape. I gotta put on this cape. What am I doing? I have to be level two. Oh my god. Eagle vision. Now we gotta get Slayer. Alright, level two. Do I want to get Oh health boost Always get your boy health boost Alright Let's go 
Oh, I gotta put on the other cape. Firearms, as soon as I turn level 4, I'm getting this revolver. I got this from the Unity Soft Club, too. So if you guys play this game or play any kind of game, just please join the Unity Soft Club. It's so cool. You get a bunch of crap for free. All right. Let's go. Get out of here, bruh. Oh. You guys see the sparks? Only two parts off the skin. And I'm stupid. Alright. Get this going. I have Eagle Vision 2 now. That is really useful. Lookouts, run to the main shelter and call reinforcements. Eliminate the lookouts to. Alright, so we better eliminate him first. There's a treasure chest right there, so we're gonna come back after I get this guy. Shut up! I'm gonna stay stealthy. Ooh, I can double assassinate them. What? What's wrong with my life? serious I wow that's great boom all right perhaps we can harness the gangs after all what the bread how did you even know how they even know I was here I whistled that's a stuff me Wow, you're cool. Oh, and you know what I also want to do? That's All right, now we got a weapon.
Perhaps we can harness the gangs after all. Fate wish. You saved Help. me. What <laughs> I did. What you Bruh. I did protect all the clinkers. Attracting the wrong kind of attention. I would be careful. Yes, you should be, Mr. Kalok. As you like. I need to put weapon my weapon on Jacob. Mr. Frost. Alright, there we go. I'm sorry if I'm not talking enough, it's just, um, this isn't really a co-op game to play, so it's kind of boring. Like, n I don't mean, like, the game is fun, fun, but, um, it's just kind of, like, can't talk to anyone on it, so it's kind of boring like that. What is this place? It's nice to meet you both at last. This is Babylon Alley. Here we make it our business to know the streets and provide children with the opportunity to control their own destinies. Clara, Mr. Green said we might be able to help one another. In exchange for our services, we ask a small favor. Well, why not? You seem to have taken most of my money. Why not take a small favor, too? There are several factories about the city that are powered almost entirely by child labor. Those children work long hours with little pay, and most are not permitted even to leave the factory grounds. They suffer terribly. I need you to save them. A small favor. In return, we offer you intelligence. Something you clearly need. No, hold on a minute. I'm late for an appointment. What are these terms? We accept. <laughs> Pleasure doing business with you. That's nasty. For what? Running? Did you guys hear that guy? He said, someone should alert the authorities, and I'm running. Wow.
Hush now. It's all very much. Less chitter chatter and more work. Next one to utter a word, spend the night trying to the fence. The leader. Oh, so if I kill him stealthy, then all the other people will leave. That's point of view. Someone fight him! Hold on, kid. Yeah, it's money. It's alright. We'll be alright. Keep your voice down. Stop you crying. I'm right here. Holy crap. Pick him up. Got you, kid. Keep quiet. Got you, fam. I'm here to help. Much appreciated, mister. Abba line and then just a temper hunt. Okay, that's cool. Oh, I'm hungry. You back off, bro. Get off him. I got you. I like being with my hood on. It reminds me of the old days when I used to play Assassin's Creed 2 and Brotherhood and Oh, I remember those. That was so cool. Remember those days. Except SEO is like, like, the thing I like about Assassin's Creed Syndicate is like, you can jump really high with them, like, like, you can actually make those big jumps that Ezio couldn't, but Ezio was, like, in my opinion, my opinion, better at climbing. Like, you, it was easier to climb with him than it is to, with them, but they can hit, like, a, uh, with Ezio, it was like a certain point where you couldn't climb high enough to grab onto a ledge, but these guys climb like five feet with them and they still grab onto it. That's the thing I like about it. I don't see Mr. Abelon. Well, we tried. I may know a thing or two about that splendid fellow you're talking about. Bro, get out What's of here. This? I would never leave. <laughs> Blow the gaff. What? Sergeant Abelon, at your service. I presume you're the Fry Twins Green mentioned. I was expecting you to be a policeman. I was expecting you to be discreet. Henry Green oh. said you could help us go unnoticed. Oh my god. 
This is how it will work. I will give you the names of criminal gang members. You will bring them back to me. Quietly. Oh, we'll be as quiet as an old lady. A very hairy, strange old lady that looks a lot like a policeman. <laughs> very strange oh my god i can't wait to be done with this story mode so i can play jack the ripper jack the ripper is so fun i don't know oh all right so tackle this dog it. He's not why is he running already? Oh my god dude. I I don't understand why he's running. Yo get him Cox. Alright, I can meet Oh my god, of course he went that way. I was gonna meet him in the main street, but I guess we're still going down the south. Yo! Get them! Get off me! Piss off! Oi! Shut your god! Meet my blade! What is it that you think I've done? You're collecting rent from people who don't owe you a shit. Yeah, me and half the Richies in this bloody city. You gonna kidnap them too? Hi, Alan. How are you doing? All right, got him done. Now, would be glad to see him bring back to All right, so thank you. Now, only one thing to do. Gotta do this Templar hunt, and then we'll be finished with this. Then we gotta beat up that other guy, get his thing, and then I think we're done with sequence three in like uh, 20, 30 more minutes. We'll be done. I didn't know how it oh, four hours oh, for 120. I thought it was 420. You don't get that. Ooh. Oh crap, he's right there. I had no idea. He was like right there. Ooh, crap. Good. Distribute the dynamite then and carefully. Very good, sir. We want this to come into the blighter's hands without gods in this day mishaps. Oh, got him. Someone take care of him. Alright, now just wait here to this guy. All right, finish this. Continue. Hey, Alan, if you're still there, um, I'll sub to you if you sub to me. Sub for sub. All right, gang war.
Sparks were real on that one. Gang war, let's go. Ah, there you are. All that stands between you and Whitechapel is the villain controlling the borough. Kaylock has demanded you settle the claim for territory in a gang fight. His loss? Yeah. I'm sure you can put this to better use than I can. Oh, what's this, Greeny? Assassin Christmas. <laughs> Gather your allies. Mr. Rexford Kaylock has agreed to your terms and waits for you at the Whitechapel train station. He's bet his train on the fine. No Kaylock. Hmm. No matter. Attack! Appears to be broken. Oh well, at least we have a train now. It's not all bad. Chapel is no longer in the hands of the blighters. 
You now have the chance to join our ranks. We welcome all who would stand up to Steric and his cutthroats. I find it funny how it's raining and their hair is just still the same as it was when it was day, like, not raining. Ah, you bastard. I'd rather throw myself to the tracks than run Bertha another mile for that doughty bow bag. Kaylock? Oh, He's look, left the station. it's what's well, her fate, Bertha. Hello, fancy pants. How do you make you I'm Evie Fry, and this is my brother, Jacob Fry. Pleased to meet you. I'm Agnes McGee. Agnes, it's delight. Agnes. The train's name I is I thought I was getting a promotion. I suppose I'm out of work now. Come work for us instead. <laughs> I always bail your heat. You pay better than scraps? Oh, I'm sure we can at least match All that. Right. Then me, I Yo, if you're watching, you, just comment. Agnes and Bertha. Lady and local ah, I knew it was Bertha. At your service. I'll be in the next car. A hideout on the rails? What an excellent idea. Yes, it all worked out rather well. Now, I would like to follow up a lead on... Jacob? Is this serious? I'm not doing anything until this gets fixed. I believe I know someone who can help with that. I knew you would, Greeny. All right, let's get into this. Now we got the train hideout. Got a new cane sword. Um, what does she want? You know, a mite of money goes a mickle bit in this city. Think of the power of good you can well, do with the purse you. you bring. You talk of a store in London. Well, now's your chance. All right, um, wow, that's really far. Oh, uh, no, I don't want to do rubber top, but I want to get all the way down here so I can get that. Nice. No, my train's leaving me. Please come back. Yay, it stopped. All right, no. What am I? Oh, there. Ooh, I need to buy some medicine. Yeah. All right, All right now we're basically. Oh my god, it just reminds me of when I was Ezio from Assassin's Creed 2. Oh. Alright, now we go over here, and let's start this up. Oh, 
blast them. Alec, whatever is the matter? I have been intercepting nothing but poppycock propaganda about soothing syrup and whatnot. No, I swear to high heavens, if Starrick's monopoly continues... Alec, I beg your pardon. These are friends of mine. Evie Fry and her brother, Jacob. Oh, um... Alexander Graham Bell. Linguist, inventor and technical expert. Alec, I have something of a favor to ask you. Can you fix this? Oh, looks like the casing is cracked. Oh, comes apart. <laughs> I see. Could have used one of these to fit my fuses on top of Big Ben. Alec is installing a new telegraph line for our Free Press Association. To combat the Static Telegraph Company. Now, if I can mend I the fuses what to the independent lines from Big Ben, Static will be weakened. Only, we are somewhat at a handicap. And, there. Oh, I've removed the mechanism, so it may work with your bracer. I'll put it to use immediately. <laughs> Jacob, wait. Mr. Bell, allow me to help you with your fuses. Oh, you will not find me too proud to accept Miss Fry. Oh, uh, we can use my carriage, if you'd be so good as to hold the reins off. I'll take that. Um, I, I can help you. All right, let's go. Oh, Miss Fry, I am so glad you could assist me. You really ought to be here by now. Far so, Mr. Bell. What inventions are you concocting? I intend to develop a phonetic telegraph that does not just convey dots and dashes, Miss Fry. <laughs> Human voice. Phonetic telegraph? <laughs> Sounds a bit of a mouthful. You could just call it a telephone. Telephone? Very bizarre. Anyway, as I was saying earlier, the press has become entirely dependent on the static telegraph company. Which is why Mr. Green has asked you to set up a free line. Yes. What is more, other small independent companies have had their lines sabotaged, and they have little means of finding any broken fuses, which are... To be... On top of Big Ben. Wow, dude. This rope helps me out. They will not so be much. a problem. I'll wow. repair the fuses. Oh my god, dude. This is freaking great. This is absolutely great. Lovely view. Hello, Giorgio. How are you doing? All set. Yo, guys, check out this view. Look at all the pollution, though. That's bad. Turn it out. It's sick. No, I'm stupid. Oh, I didn't even mean to do that, but what? Sucks, and I didn't do the challenge. God dang it.
should do it. There we go. Took forever to say three out of three. Yep. No. This is a decentralized, no decentralized. Well, I should look at the view now. Up here. Oh my god, dude, that's gonna look sick. Insane. All right, let's get this uh, done. Mm -mm. Why is it going so slow? Wow. <laughs> I love sliding down roofs. It's like, it's great. Oh God. Get! <sighs> I swear to God, EV sometimes you're stupid. What was that? That was so weird. I like, oh my God, that glitched out really bad. What the heck? Thank you very much, Miss Fry. I will oh, now wow, be able to continue with the installation of the new line. If there's anything else I can do to help. Uh, certainly. Please do come and visit. Oh, uh, I was toying with this device and have noted down the formula for you. It, it's not perfect yet, but by golly, it works. Whoa, 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 whoa. Well, maybe, maybe a little too well. Oh, my God. Dude, my last video, like, there were so many people watching it. And now I only have, like, four people that I want to see it. Come on! Come on! Faster! Come on! Move it! Jump! Faster!
craft new gear, tool upgrades, and the inventory and crafting menus. Find unique resources and crafting plants and hidden chests, income activities, especially robbing cargo from trains, carts, and boats, provide large amounts of crafting resor resources. Alright, so smoke bomb upgrade and then it wants us to upgrade our throwing them. <sighs> Reach Bell's Workshop. Like, my most favorite weapon in this game is absolutely hydraulic darts. They are so OP. Hydraulic darts are so OP. Especially with Jacob, because um, uh, with the actual outfit, it gives you one more of them, so it's totally worth it. And then after you're done with that mission that Bell gives you, to go get all the supplies that they that the um, they stole from him, it's so worth it. Cause now, then after that you can upgrade your hydraulic dirt uh, thing. So ah, on him you get fine. five, and on Eve uh, you get four. I was four. just showing Jacob it's the so first message was received via the mended lines. Oh, uh, you can keep the rope launcher. By the way, um, we've managed to procure another one for your brother. Excellent work. Thank you again. Mm. You're very welcome, Mr. Bell. We can now defend the principle of impartial news and free speech. Free is fair, but free and brief is far better. Ha <laughs> ha! Ah, fry, such caustic wit. <laughs> and on that note, we must depart. <laughs> oh, uh, good fortune to you both. Uh, call on me, at any time. Boom. Now that we've finished with that distraction... Who is that? Oh, you mean... you don't know? Beautiful train you got here. Miss McBean was just telling me all about her. Uh... His name's Ned. Ned! Ned Ward. I won't take up more of your time. Uh, if you want to learn a thing or two about the finest transit systems in the world, you can find me at this address. Let us return to locating the piece of Eden. All right. We need to reclaim London from Starry. I think we just finished Who sequence are my three. Targets? It's not time for that yet. I didn't come to London to hunt Cheerios. First understand the dance, only then become the dancer. Oh, so you're taking over where father left off. Someone has to. Evie, finding the precursor artifact will give us an insight into what the temple is intent. Jacob, I have information about Starek's associates that should be of use to you. Here. Conquer London. Use the assassination wall on the train hideout to track the next Templar target. Extend territory by completing conquest activities. Complete associate activities to earn money, crafting resources, and unique rewards. Okay. That is the end of sequence three. I'll just make sure. Um, yes, that is the end of sequence three. I will see you guys in my next Assassin's Creed video. It might be in a couple hours. I don't know for sure, but I will see you guys later. Subscribe, like the video. Thanks a lot, guys. Peace out.